No, God, Jesus, Jesus Christ of Nazareth, does not forgive every sin. There is a sin that God won't forgive. Starting at Mark 3.21, we're going to read Mark 3.21 through 22. When his own people heard of this, they went out to take custody of him, for they were saying he has lost his senses. The scribes who came down from Jerusalem were saying, He is possessed by Beelzebub, and he cast out the demons by the ruler of the demons. And we're going to skip down to verse 28. You can go read the full thing for yourself. It says, Truly I say to you, all sin shall be forgiven the sons of men, and whatever blasphemies they utter. Then 29 and 30 says this, But whoever blasphemes against the Holy Spirit never has forgiveness, but is guilty of an eternal sin because they were saying he has an unclean spirit. This, trans this translation says this, he said this because they were saying he has an un impure spirit, Mark 3.30. So, what is blasphemy of the Holy Spirit? It's speaking against the Holy Spirit. That is, that's a sin that God will not forgive. Now we're going to read Matthew 12, 31 through 32. Therefore I say to you, any sin and blasphemy shall be forgiven people, but blasphemy against the Spirit shall not be forgiven. Whoever speaks a word against the Son of Man, it shall be forgiven him. But whoever speaks against the Holy Spirit, it shall not be forgiven him, either in this age or in the age to come. Either in this age or in the age to come. No, blasphemy of the Holy Spirit is not not accepting Jesus Christ. That's why it says, Whoever speaks a word against the Son of Man, it shall be forgiven him. But whoever speaks against the Holy Spirit, see, it separates it. 1 John 5.16 says, If anyone sees his brother committing a sin not leading to death, he shall ask, and God will for him give life to those who commit sin not leading to death. There is a sin leading to death. I do not say that he should make requests for this. What is, okay, what's an example of blasphemy of the Holy Spirit? Uh, go, and meet, go and read Mark 3.22. Uh, it shows an example, and then right after that event, Jesus talks about blasphemy of the Holy Spirit, that it's not uh, able to be forgiven. Amen. Praise God. Praise the Lord Jesus Christ.